baby boys, uh, the uh, Max Graphics GT5 clips are back. We have a Porsche over here. Dude, look at the angle. He's going straight and sideways at the same time. The physics have like left the chat, uh, but it, it's just satisfying. Like the colors are just so bright. It's just, it's beautiful. Holy, we are inside of a plane and what? Wait, can you actually play games inside planes? I've never been on a plane. Is this what flying is like? You just play video games there? I'm afraid of heights. I don't want to go on a plane, but now I want to. Just for this experience. We have a slow motion. And yes, this is GTA 5 clip. Slow motion. Full angle with this RX-7. The graphics are looking out of this world. Like, I don't know how many mods he has. But just, dude. <laughs> it looks like Forza Horizon 5. I would even say better with the background being all, all blurry and stuff like that. It just looks great. This looks lovely. That is the most realistic sim setup you will ever see. And he's drifting on this Shotoku HRTQV from TikTok. And we have GTA 6 Early Access. I'm just kidding. It's GTA 5 with graphics modern. I mean, it pretty much looks like GTA 6. Let's be honest. And there is more. So yeah, this man is sending in a lot of dope clips over here. It seems like he has kind of like changed the physics of the game cool slow motion by the way over here i don't know how people do that but both of the clips look very similar and very awesome now speaking of graphics guys ain't no game gonna beat gran turismo 7 matros uh, 360 as well with this hellcat over here and let me guess yeah he's gonna do one more over here 10 out of 10 clip love to see it now this is a game that doesn't need graphics mod to look awesome this is gran turismo 7 out of the box and trolls a man 360 as well and Valsid is back drifting with uh, with a truck in BMG and uh, apparently this man can drift in any game he drifts in Assetto, BMG and Gran Turismo well I just said it this is the same dude but in Gran Turismo 7 with an absolutely mad 360 with a Mustang over here dude also the graphics just I mean discuss name a game which by default looks better in terms of graphics than Gran Turismo 7 I guarantee you you can't guys i can't get over the fact that this game looks better than real life guys look at this the way the camera kind of moves around this wall it just makes it seem like it's actually real life it just looks way too good someone sent me this video showing his handmade handbrake you look at that he has a mouse or something on top of the handbrake as well that's really cool the handbrake presses a button on the shifter that's how it works carl carlson over here I haven't seen this man in a while. He's a YouTuber as well on a Logitech setup with an eBay handbrake whipping an SRT over there, I think. That jump was, by the way, sick. Now, guys, let me know what do you think about these graphics. This feels like a little too overdone. Like, I feel like I need to take off my sunglasses. Everything is just so bright. Next clip has absolutely mesmerizing graphics and the depressing vibes of the rain car looks realistic physics look realistic because the game is a set of course on just all the camera shots are nicely done just some very chill toge clips beam and g one of the most difficult drifting games ever created well not a drifting game but a game where you can drift on even though this man is doing 360s like it's absolutely nothing over here two guys are going in on a modded track and they are both throwing a 360 and ending up up in a tandem that is mad skill right there it almost kind of looks like he's drifting in vr but he's not i think he has yeah three different monitors which kind of blend in together uh makes it look really cool and the game is a set of course about it another gran turismo clip he's on a wheel i think that's his first wheel cam clip you look at this throwing 360s like it's nothing here is the classic game is to jump in a set of course we got a truck over here i gotta say love the car variety or uh, you know a truck variety drifting a truck is not easy now this is a bmg clip very cool a bmw was towing a bmw i like it drives off the trailer with his drift missile bmw and we have a wheel cam as well i think that's a moza r5 throws a 360 entry as well i think that's a bmw logo on the steering wheel as well actually this man definitely likes bmws gran turismo with those a 
amazing graphics again. And yeah, Gran Turismo also has the famous Shutoku track. And dude, that car looks so clean. Dude, the graphics are just so crispy, dude. And not a 360 as well. Wow! Cadillac drifting between AI traffic in a set of cars are probably no hazy, right? Sideways drifting is the man. And the man's setup is clean. We have Pete Cam on top right corner as well. I just noticed he is actually drifting in first person view as well, which makes it even more impressive. Throws a 360 as well. I mean, this is a beautiful clip. We have rain over here. And he is sideways as well. The man can drift. The man can race. Like, guys, let me know if you know anyone with a better setup than this. Like, this is the number one setup right there. In terms of, like, sim racing. Maybe one day we'll see something better. But this is it. This is the peak right here. I mean, this is probably the second best setup I've seen. Man has half a vehicle in his living room. I believe it's an old Audi. Correct me if I'm wrong, boys. Nighttime drifting over here. Throws a 360 as well. The sky is definitely very mesmerizing. Let me tell you that. Kind of cool vibes over here. I like it. Here is something for first person view lovers as well. We have a little battle going on over here. Look at that. The BMW in front is even using blinkers. Guys, history has been made. We caught a BMW 4K 1080p using blinkers. Boy, sideways drifting is back. Okay. That's a very interesting camera angle. I cannot see what is happening in front. It's kind of scary. But very lovely. Uh, nice. Oh, there we go. Throws a 360 as well. Gotta flex with a 360, right? Gran Turismo. The game that PC players have wet dreams about because we can't play it. Beautiful. Look at it. All we drive drifted. Noise. Well, here is something again for first person view lovers. We have a 2000 horsepower Lambo Hurricane with only 60% turbo. This is only 60%. Not even the final form, boys. GTA drift stunt. Look at that. Takes a ramp over here. Lands in the verse. No, it doesn't. Flips it around. Beautiful. Is he playing on Mario Kart track? I think he is. Wait, there's a, there's a jump over here as well. Takes the jump as well. Oh, wait, what? Okay, that was a very weird landing. Beam and G, boys. We're gonna see some amazing drifting. I was wrong. Attempt number two. We're just gonna see some... Wow, that, oh, that was a... Yep, there we go. Barrel roll. And continues drifting. I'll take it. Another clip from Sideways. Okay, Sideways has been bombarding me with the emails lately. Okay, I like it. Yes, it's clean. Chill drifting. Doing some toge. A very beat up car over here. This is the JBX or something. It's literally one of the best drift cars in Beam and G. We have a cinematic clip over here as well. Gave us a little wink with the pop-up taillights over here. This literally looks like these street takeovers that are happening in US. Which are very dangerous. Don't participate in them. Okay. I believe this is Pacific Island if I'm not mistaken. Very cool map. We have a BMW ripping on this uh, uphill road. Yeah, set of course is just a beautiful game. I don't know what else to tell you. Oh, baby. Look at that, boys. The sky in itself is just breathtaking. Nighttime Shitoku with AI traffic. I mean, that is the new meta. This is what everyone is doing nowadays. Here a cinematic on a highway simulator look at that and it's beautiful i mean once again someone has spent a lot of effort in making this video the mods just bring the game to life if we didn't have mods in a set of cards that nobody would play it boys cat reveal look at it look at the cat there is a cat over there i know he's drifting and the setup is sick but look at the cat cat is like yo what's up what are you doing the drifting was so amazing that even the cat was mesmerized race car racing i missed you dude look at the wheel cam man is inside of a car and he's not like it's so trippy the dashboard is from inside of the game it's not in his living room boys here are some toilet paper rolls and check that out gone Someone is having fun with an RC car over here. Beautiful. This clip is by SMH Inc. Goes through this narrow box container. Slow motion. Graphics are dialed in. I actually can't believe this is a 10 year old gamer watching. This is what you can do with mods. Let me keep on watching. We have some slow motion going on over here. Okay, some wet roads as well. You know, the enhance the graphics. Yeah, it looks good. 10 out of 10 clip. Lambo and we have a wheel cam as well. I believe that is the Moza R5, which I do have as well. And a beautiful Lambo over here. That's my favorite Lambo, by the way. Clip by Drino. And Drino is drifting in Carrick's bump somebody and the other car starts break dancing very fascinating <laughs> Okay, here is some very satisfying graphics in a set of course. A first person view. Lambo as well. Probably a no hezzy, right? We have AI traffic over here. Dude, what a beautiful looking game. 9 out of 10. Oh my god, dude. That is the longest handbrake I have ever seen in my life. Dude has to actually reach for the handbrake. 
why is it so long look at this stick by the way this is not a set of course that this is gta even though it looks nothing like that yeah we want to the track by the way if anyone is wondering okay this is very impressive guys you are all using controllers or wheels or keyboards this man is controlling the vehicle with only his mouth so a clip from Goga Turp, very impressive jumps over the plane as well amazing dude check it out he's gonna take the jump there we go but uh yeah this is uh, driver san francisco game support wheels amazing game boys did you know that gran turismo 7 has vr because i didn't know that that is the first time i see vr in this game all righty what do we have over here he's driving an audi rs6 and we have a wheel cam as well a ferrari wheel look at that there's a lot of traffic over here holy almost crashed over there very cool bmng drift clip it's kind of cinematic i like like it the graphics are dialed in as much as they can in bmg you know bmg doesn't look the best but it's a great game but he's gonna drift underneath the truck like it's nothing fast and furious baby and he's still going on here is a porsche i never know how to pronounce it correctly the porsche or porsche e but very cool car model i wish we had car models with proper badges in bmg the only way we can have them is with sus mods boys no hesse from wish.com dude look at the graphics he has not maxed out the graphics but guys the graphics is not the most important part of gameplay you know what is fun you don't need max graphics boom 360 as well look at that man's having fun what a giga chat oh here is the same dude again that we have seen a couple of times today dude look at the graphics it looks even better when it's dark this is greed dude i remember drifting in greed that was like years ago drifting in greed was a little weird it was a little faster pace kind of like in need for speed but not as bad it was better Val sent us this drift clip and he is using a logitech g29 we have the shifter and ebay handbrake as well here's some drift in action as well check it out it brings back memories that was my first setup by the way like three years ago i like it here is a bmw look at this entry it's magnificent locks the rear tires as well there and another entry over here as well goes even wider than last time holy mother of geese ford fiesta front wheel drive look at that locks the rear tires over there boom boys here is some asmr for you you're welcome a lot of flames in a set of course that you look at that exhaust you could barbecue a chicken on that exhaust very rainy kind of sad vibes over here in a set of course uh, very depressing 10,000 horsepower stock Supra sideways in Forza Horizon 5 doing a 360 like it's nothing boom that's how it's done oh my god dude who brought a mommy wagon over here what is there's no way you're gonna drift that come on show me oh wow wait is this actually rear wheel drive dude his license plate says some to goose as well i like it thank you for the shout out look at that 360 as well yeah guys subscribe and your mom will do 360s guaranteed here is some mesmerizing graphics as well not gta this time actually i said of course check it out i'll be honest gta even looked better than that i don't know why i kind of prefer the gta graphics look at the rear end of this car does anyone know what this car is if you do let me know in the comments educate me also look at that angle wait is he gonna do a 360 as well he is wait it actually looks really good here is a dude with the wheel cam g29 three pedals has the keyboard rgb keyboard what else do you need look at that sideways nissan s14 throwing some mad slides over here very nice Gran Turismo, look at that, once again we have Ovid Drive, I think that's a Ford Focus, flexing his abilities, noise. Boys, how do you do? We have an Audi over here, look at that, amazing angle, Ovid Drive, but the Audi is not done. Goes in reverse and takes the whole corner in reverse like it's nothing. Gran Turismo, once again, we even have the Gran Turismo steering wheel, there's literally GT on the steering wheel as well. Trustmaster TH8A handbrake pulls that as well. What are you whipping, by the way? What is this small thing? A big send, boys. Illegal street drifting with a Nissan S15. Woo! Really good engine sound as well. Boys, Assetto Corsa with max graphics. I lied. This is real life, okay? You, you, you were debated. Let me know in the comments if you were debated. I believe it's a Nissan 350Z. This is literally what fun looks like. If you can afford to drift in real life on a drift track, do it. This is the most realistic game ever made. Still, 
and you guessed it, it's BMG. Don't get me wrong, like I said, of course, is nice, but BMG does have car damage, right? And also, check out these mad parking skills over here as well. Perfection. Oh, wait, this is the game that got cancelled, I believe. There was literally a game which I played, and the next day it got cancelled. Like, the download link was taken off by the owner. Man, that is sad. That game had a lot of potential. Ooh, baby, a red 180. Look at that. AI traffic. Please tell me you're gonna drift. Oh, here we go. He's gonna pass this car sideways. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's pretty wild. Here is my favorite Forza Horizon game, you guys know. Forza Horizon 3. Now, the weather is horrible over here. I get, like, UK vibes over here. But the map is in Australia. Here is BMG, a lovely-looking blue Nissan R34 over here. And he promised us a reverse entry. So, whoa, that was not a reverse entry. That was a whole 360 in reverse. I mean, I'll take it. Here is BMG. That is the equivalent of a 180 in BMG. Like, BMG can't really have realistic the cars this is the closest we have to the nissan oh i like it it's like a cinematic clip over here car wrecks on a wheel ebay and break does a little 360 entry pretty wild dude this is parenting done right guys you gotta teach him young if i ever have a kid if he can stand up and walk i'm gonna put him behind the wheel classic oir full send over here with a nissan s15 would you look at that here is a bmw you look at the driver there's like a human being in there i mean usually the dude inside has like a helmet on but not this time without the helmet this looks way better here is a bus sideways in a set of corza look at that i tried this mod out as well it slides pretty good dude i thought this was a set of corza for a second this is bmng can you actually believe this is no hensy but in bmng <laughs> that is so wild like the mirrors are completely useless but if you squint your eyes kind of like a set of corza all right mustang in forza horizon 5 full sending it and let me guess that's gonna be the longest reverse entry ever and yep i was correct look at that not bad dude are you kidding me what <laughs> that's not even a driver that's like a dummy like a crash test dummy over there doing wheelies with a go-kart in bmng oh he's drifting as well oh there's police dude. what is happening dude this is the best bmng drift clip of all time slow motion jumps over the cars lands it as well who is this dude that's another go-kart doing a wheelie i feel like i'm living in a matrix right now or maybe that's the new meta go-karts doing 360s and drifting if only drifting was a little easier in bmg dude i get so frustrated drifting with a wheel in bmg but amazing clip this drift car is jbx 100 it is probably the best drift car in bmg in terms of like handling that is the easiest car for drifting there's some good stock cars as well but the jbx 100 i feel like nothing can be that dude someone is drifting in a set of corza with an f1 wheel i literally did the same challenge the other day moza racing sent me the f1 wheel and i was drifting in a set of corza with it as well dude that is hard here is need for speed guys honestly one thing that need for speed has nailed down is the graphics dude look at the city in the background it's beautiful just straight street racing vibes oh my god dude is this real life or are we just in matrix this is a video game i just came from outside 30 minutes ago the graphics are worse this looks better than real life or maybe i just need to get glasses it's one or the other drift clip by rob tom he says sub to the goose yeah guys if you subscribe to the goose scientifically proven you'll be able to drift like this dude look at these math skills i feel like this is the most famous drifting area in bmg the tokyo drift parking lot section over here if you can drift all the way up in bmg like that then honestly math skills boys who ordered taxi look at that drift taxi over here imagine you order drift taxi and instead of the driver driving normally it's sideways here is an ebisu jump full send boom <laughs> Uh, I don't know what I'm watching, but I'm watching something. Here's someone's point of view. Look at that. I said, of course, a drift in first person view, like a Giga Chat, right? Only noobs drift in third person view. Dude, this is like one of the best looking car wreck drift clips I've ever seen. It looks so clean. Some kind of a modded track over here. Really decent drifting as well. Karex looks really good on this clip. This is Need for Speed, and he was sent flying. Oh, baby, cinematic 4 and 5 drift clip. 
The old Monster Crunch are literally the best drift cars in Forza. I don't know why. Mercedes? Okay, he's probably gonna do a 360. Yep, there we go. How did I know? It's like I can predict the future. It's pretty wild. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, okay. I didn't predict he was gonna park the car over here. Real life clip BMW. Is it the old 5 Series? I think it is. Some kind of a lovely drift event going on over here. Oh, yeah, that's the 5 Series. Yes. BMW is a nice bunch of drift cars. Oh my god, Need for Speed Underground. Are you kidding me? The Underground was the very first car game I ever played. I remember these drift tracks in these old Need for Speed games. And it was so much fun. That was my favorite part of the game. Real life drift clip. I think he's in a BMW E36 and a Skyline in front over there. I'd be so scared to tap the car in front. The Skyline looks so clean. Holy mother of graphics, guys. That is a 10-year-old game. GTA 5 <laughs> looks nothing like my GTA 5, but it's absolutely stunning. The drifting physics don't make any sense, but it's not the point. Yeah, I don't know what kind of NASA PC do you gotta have to run all these graphics mods, but it looks pretty good. There we go. Proper drifting physics. A set of course. Look at the fancy wheel cam as well. Man has neons on his wheel cam. Bro, there we go. First person view action as well, doing some toge, whipping a T150 over there. Nice. Yo, this is Forza Horizon 5, but they're doing toge and it's a custom map. Uh, I don't even get Forza Horizon 5 vibes from watching this video. It literally looks like a completely different game. Here is your favorite content. Shotoku AI traffic, but we have a little twist. We ain't racing. We be sideways. We're drifting, throwing, mad uh, reverse entries. Okay, I thought it was gonna be a 360, but I got jibated there. Well, here is some sweet graphics for you one second. Look at the Thunderstrike in the background as well. Does 360s, lands, uh, cheese, slow motion, cops, planes i don't know what is happening that is that is pretty wild <laughs> well here is some asmr graphics from aceto cross as well look at the grass the grass literally looks more realistic than real life again we have 3d grass in aceto corsa now uh, it's a new feature you could actually enable it in the content manager that is one of the best looking toga maps i've ever seen the trees look a little weird though project sim racing presents Lovely footage over here. Man has fanatic. I don't know what else he has. Uh, yeah, he's a YouTuber. Does crazy stuff. Man has the most impressive setup I've ever seen. And most importantly, has the skills as well. Gran Turismo 7. Look at the GTR. Honestly, you know, if it was on PC, I would probably play 24-7 just because the graphics. I, I believe, by default, the best looking game out there without any mods. Guys, look at the yellow car approaching. Nissan does a 360 and somehow they didn't crash and they end up in a tandem. What was that? Gran Turismo 7 once again. I can barely see anything. There's so much dust going on. There we go. I see the GTR trying to get the lead over here. This is the finish. Jumps over the finish line, basically. <laughs> Actually got first place there. Ice Vale sent us this clip. We have fancy drone cams and nice graphics. Look at the wheel cam as well. Lovely BMW E92, I believe. Just mesmerizing. BMG full send. Max throttle full send sideways. Look at that. Like it's nothing. It's not done yet. Keeps it going. Still sideways. I don't know how you guys control your vehicles in BMG. It's impressive, honestly. First person view drifting in Gran Turismo 7. I don't think I've ever seen first person view. Wait, in Gran Turismo 7, the wheel doesn't turn 900 degrees as well? I thought that was only Forza's problem. Well, here is some very colorful graphics. I do like the brake lights on the BMW. They kind of glow. Oh, it drifts as well. It's a pretty, pretty heavy boy, but I can hold the slide. Aceto Corza, Nissan. What is that? S13. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. Some toge action. Car looks absolutely stunning. Mad skills. Beautiful. Boys, GTA. I think this is probably San Andreas, right? It's like an older GTA. It's definitely not GTA 5. Does some really weird drifting over your physics dot exe has left the chat finally a proper tandem boys look at that karma drift sent us this clip you check that out couple of bmws yo the dude is waving his hand out the window the lead car you guys seen that i've never seen that before gran turismo 7 dude the graphics are they should be illegal and also very juicy on 34 
big entry in a set of Corsa. Check that out. The biggest reverse entry you've ever seen in your life. Oh my god. Driver San Francisco. The game is just pure chaos. I uh, really kind of want to try out this game. But yeah, absolutely crazy game. This is not edited. This is literally the gameplay. What a peaceful afternoon. Uh, Nissan Leaf over here. And boom! A drifter just passing by. Street racer. Oh, we have street racer's point of view over here as well. Beautiful. What is this? Uh, Takumi over here racing against somebody that is side by side. They're going into a corner. Takumi takes the inside sideways and actually gains the lead position. Woo! Nissan S15 in Fort Rosen 5 on a custom map as a little jump trick over here as well. Yeah, custom maps are lovely in Forza. A tiny Clio ripping it in Gran Turismo 7. You look at this small vehicle. I don't think I've ever seen this car sideways. Extremely beautiful graphics over here in a set of Forza once again. Drifting with a BMW through traffic like it's nothing. I really love the flames. I like the sunset on this clip. Throws a 360 as well. Mesmerizing. There is something wrong with this RX-7. It's literally crap walking. Oh, the left tire is completely messed up. It's RX-7 going sideways and forwards at the same time. Oh, it's missing a wheel as well. Need for speed carbon. Cup gets yeeted. Boom. Parenting done right. Dude, the wheel is bigger than the driver. <laughs> I like it. Guys, there is a cop car sideways in a set of course. Oh, look at that. Honestly, drifts very good. 180SX. Look at that. Full sending it in Toge. I don't know if we have AI traffic. Would be pretty cool if we do. Maybe next time you can add a wheel cam as well. Would be sick. Driver San Francisco. Dude, this game needs to be revived. Who's with me? We need to start a petition to revive this game. This game always looks so full of action. I love it. This clip for a split second like made me question if this is a game or not but yeah if you look at the trees and everything it's definitely a game oh so apparently in a set of course there are also these arab drift servers which is pretty fun like you have a lot of front wheel drive cars and you can just full send them need for speed drifting it's fast it's grippy it's kind of weird but they nailed the graphics but speaking of need for speed this is way better need for speed underground 2 was a little jump drift over there 360 jump drift avoids the car as well nice again bmw with flames what i do want to say is don't let this clip fool you this is way more difficult than it looks like on the clip an rx7 going completely bananas very crazy entry this is need for speed payback i believe some kind of a porsche sideways over here dude the speed is insane he's going drifting in corners over 200 miles per hour oh my god dude what is this honda civic in rocket leagues guys this is rocket league the game where there's miniature cars and a football but with mild you can transform anything and he's taking a very weird shortcut okay i didn't know that shortcut existed even there project sim racing officially the best setup ever guys look at the screen edges you can't even see the screen edges if you look carefully one of the car a pillars is covering the screen edge i think you can only see the left edge barely. This is sick. Man literally made a one long monitor, but with three monitors that don't have edges. This is sick. This is the crew too, and in this game, you can also drift very smooth. Uh, the drifting physics are not realistic at all. It's very weird. Here is the setup that everyone is jealous of. Boom, Taurus hammer over here. Whipping on a Thrustmaster wheel. Shifter in the correct place as well. Very insane setup. Oh, it's raining. Sending it through traffic. Dude, there's all sorts of bosses as well. I like that. Like the variety of AI cars in this server is very nice. Look at these big trucks. This is really interesting vibes. It's autumn, right? Leaves are falling. We have a yellow Lexus over here. Wait, this is the LFA. This is officially the best sounding car in real life, I believe. That's the title. One of a kind engine sound on this vehicle. Dude, what is this game? Why are you going there? What? Jesus. Wait, man got yeeted? Oh my god, wow. Dude, listen to the car sound. Jesus. Here is a BRZ in Forza Horizon 4, I think. Doing a 360, avoids the NPC car. Mustang full sending it to be here. Very decent graphics. Very nice cinematic clip. You can see the city in the background as well. This behind shot, I like a lot. Yo, check that out. Like a drone following the Mustang. Beautiful. Here is an RX-7 doing a 360 in Forza Horizon 5. Nate sent us this clip and it's a car doing a wheelie in Forza. Look at this spoiler, dude. I love 
love the way the spoiler moves. <laughs> it's so mesmerizing to watch. And did a 360 as well. This is done by a professional. Don't attempt. This is on a closed parking lot, private road. It's not even real life. It's a game. It's a set of course. Okay, shut up. This is GTA 5, which now is pretty much an old game, right? Background is blurred. The colors are pumped up. I like it. Drifting is nice and smooth. He can just go straight and sideways at the same time. I don't know. The physics don't make any sense, but it's satisfying to look at. And I think that's all that matters. Next clip, we have a really insane tandem in Gran Turismo 7. We don't usually see tandem clips in Gran Turismo 7 but now with you look at these amazing liveries they're like dancing they're so close boys hide your weed the cops are coming look at that and they're coming sideways I don't know why it says freedom but uh happy freedom boys speaking of freedom here is freedom but in Forza Horizon 5 a big American truck sideways like it's nothing here we go here's some beautiful AI traffic combined with some very smooth drifting look at this BMW oh and there's an Evo as well I don't I don't think the Evo is interested in drifting. Oh god, what is this? Here is a barrel in a bathtub sideways in I'm gonna assume this is Gary's mod and I think there's some kind of an anime character as well in there yeah I don't know what I'm watching to be honest here is a muscle car sideways in Gran Turismo and I've always said this guys old muscle cars in any game are the best drift cars I don't know why they shouldn't be but even in Forza the old muscle cars at least on a steering wheel they're so smooth instead of Gran Turismo 7 we now have an old Gran Turismo game I think this might be Gran Turismo 3 and there is a sky doing a 360 entry dude the physics are so good though for such an old game the graphics look so bad though but i like it guys look at this man's steering wheel he has a bmw logo but he's using a logitech g29 he has just swapped the original wheel has the classic ebay handbrake as well and the g29 shifter very nice setup right there mustang going full send into the house i don't know how did he jump over the house how did he do that and he is still going. Nothing can stop this Mustang, boys. Some very satisfying GTA 5 drift. And look at that. And is he gonna do a 360 jump drift? He is. I'm so glad I didn't close the clip. Dude, that looks sick. He even lost the spoiler there. <laughs> Mana sent us this clip, boys. My favorite Forza Horizon game, Forza Horizon 3 over here. And obviously, he has to flex with a 360 as well with his lovely 4 Escort. Beautiful game, man. Okay, guys, the graphics mod have gone too far. We need to talk about this. This is too much. You have now crossed the line. We need to go back. Dude, the most famous Live for Speed player, Ducky, always delivering. He's gonna do something awesome. Yep, there we go. Jumped over two barriers with this long sword and there is no way you're doing a 360 that was a reverse entry that was even better jesus here is someone full sending a bmw guys if you buy a bmw this is how you should drive it but only in a video game only in a video game drive safe okay don't drive like that in real life oh lord dude this is bmng and i think i might know what the map is as well I played a similar map in BMG, like a Tokyo City map, and this kind of reminds me. But these graphics are wild. It's kind of like a set of Corsa, like the attention to detail on the map and the car. It's insane. Absolutely angry looking R34. I cannot believe this is BMG, but it is. Very short BMG drift clip. Nissan S15. Very angry looking, dude. The graphics are spot on over here. I'm sorry, what's up? The goose or we unleash a goose in your room? But maybe people want the goose in the room. That's a really bad incentive. But the entry over here looking fabulous. Man was like 90 degree angle. Gran Turismo 7 and obviously there has to be a weave livery on that mega hypercar. Which seems to be drifting awfully good. I don't know why I said awfully. It's not supposed to drift. He even did a 360. And he's gonna do a jump drift 360. Look at that. Tell me that wasn't fabulous. 400 kilometers per hour dude i was looking at the speedometer it said over 400 kilometers per hour i don't know how he's not crashing with this lambo jesus dude listen to this car Gran Turismo once again and I have a feeling this is an old muscle car because again old muscle cars are the best drift cars in video games just mark my word if you don't believe me go and try it out Mustang going for a huge yeet as the uh, kids say why is it purple by the way I'm gonna let that slide uh, does a barrel roll and continues his lovely drift over there dude okay I take it back the best car game ever made is this 
Test Drive Unlimited 2 and he's doing a 360 over here as well. Dude, I had so many great memories in this game. Guys, this is a true story. Somebody did this at their work and asked their security to send the footage of their drift they did at workplace. If you know this guy, don't snitch on him. This is a set of Corsa on maximum graphics, and actually, I'm lying. Uh, this is not a this is not a set of Corsa. It's real life, guys. This is where you should practice drifting, not drive dangerously on the streets. Like a local drift track, like this man is doing. Shotoku AI traffic. Man's drifting with a BMW E92, which even uh, spits flames more than me after Taco Tuesday. Yeah, definitely loves his 360s. Car looking clean, lovely romantic sunset going on. I like it. Now, guys, I don't know. Is that actually a game or real life? Guys, hold on. Just look at the buildings on the left. Guys, focus on the buildings on the left. Like, look at this. Like, when the car passes close by, I can tell it's a video game by the lights. But the background, it's it's real life. Am I, am I, am I crazy? Also, this is pretty trippy as well. So half of the car interior on the screen is in a game. And the rest of it, the wheel and the hands are from real life. Honestly, one of the best setups I've seen. I think this could be sideways drifting. Man, this man has been doing some great content. Holy dude. Well, boys, the graphics are dialed in, dude. You can even see the dirt on the windshield when the sun is kind of like shining on the glass. And we're doing some tight toge. We have the famous Takumi in front over here. Just a beautiful, beautiful game with filters and mods, right? And this, once again, Gran Turismo. I mean, this game has the best graphics by default. It's a fact. Uh, it does a 360 as well with a Mustang. I mean, it is the best racing game on PlayStation. Well, here's some more toge. A Nissan S15 chasing the Skyline R34 over here. The most famous Live for Speed player, Ducky, is back. And look at this car in front. <laughs> But a duck is just flexing with a 316 with his BMW 46. Beautiful. We're gonna go back in time, boys. This is the first Forza Horizon game ever launched. Forza Horizon 1, and he is doing a 360 entry as well. Okay, we have a cool little cinematic clip sent in. It's GTA 5. We have a front-wheel drive Civic and a street racing illegally. And it's 3 a.m. as well. Classic Civic drivers during 3 a.m., right? But a very cool, like a mini movie over here. I love it. So look at this clip. If you're uh, like parked in tight between two cars, this is how you get out. Look at this. You uh, rotate the wheel all the way to the left to a little burnout and kind of crap walk out. Guys, this is the future. Here is some rainy vibes over here. A 180 ripping it. Little barbecue coming out of the exhaust. Wheel cam clip. Let's go. We have a deep dish wheel. Look at this cinematic zoom. It feels like someone is like recording with a cell phone. Kind of similar vibes. And they both do a 360 and huh? Okay, the uh, deal in front of the 360 and okay that was the weirdest 360 tandem i've ever seen beam ng the jbx 100 i believe is the mod which is unofficially the uh, best drift car in the whole game at least for steering wheel users drifting on some kind of a dark area we have slow motion as well and finishes it off with a 360 look at that sweden tank over here look at his long sausage ripping it hard some mad grip over here Car sounds gnarly. Wow. Overdrive power. Spitting flames from the engine bay. That's raw power right there. BMW. What is it? E E60. Yeah, BMW E60 throwing a 360 in, in Carrex. Noise. Here is a Mercedes AMG with mad power. Like, I feel like this man is even struggling to kind of put the power down. It's just like letting it rip. Um, here is some kind of a weird car. I believe it's for, oh, it's a front wheel drive Chinese drift car. Okay, so this is what you drift over there in the Asian countries. Okay, I mean, it seems to be drifting pretty good. Here is again Porsche, but this time instead of racing, we're sideways and it's raining hard, so we. It is slippery and it's a GT3 car as well. So it's gonna be, yeah, he's on the grass over there struggling with the grip, but still kind of sideways, which is impressive to be honest. Well, boys, believe it or not, but this game is 10 years old. It's GTA 5. This is a 5M server called Hashiria. And I did a little 360 as well. So basically like the uh, classic Shotoku with AI traffic setting over here. And this is fake GTA. So the map is from GTA, but the game is a set of Corazon. There's like a whole traffic jam on the left. Dude, look at this line. Probably leads to McDonald's or something. Shotoku with AI traffic first person view. Oh my god, that was really tight in there. I don't know how 
now even made it. Uh, well, he probably, yep, he's gonna do a 360 over here, whipping the wheel like crazy. Uh, beautiful. Here he is, a Nissan S13. Look at this, nice and wide over here. Car sounds rowdy. Boy. This is Conrex the Classic Episode Jump crashes into the barrier, does a flip and continues like a Giga Chad. So a lot of you think that you can't uh, be smooth on controller. You can definitely drift with a controller, so you don't need to buy a wheel for a set of Corsa. Here is a BMW again, uh, drifting between traffic. It seems to have like a lot of grip and almost no grip at the same time. Like it's really wiggly, like look at the wiggle. <laughs> Guys, look at this. We are on a beach and guess what we brought well not me this is not my clip this is sideways drifting by the way we have a direct drive wheel on the beach and check that out man actually set it all up as well the whole setup on the beach publicly and this is also the same man the sideways drifting man but guys we do have a surprise check that out a lovely cute cat i mean look at this thing look at this thing but there's more he has two cats well that's a lot of cat skills hold three cats there is three fluffy kittens man's living life and here is a drift event somewhere out of nowhere wait is that a g2 fast logo wait this is a g2 fast logo over there <laughs> need for speed ladies and gentlemen and this is what drifting looks like in there need for speed carbon look at that now i was told that he is using some kind of graphics mod over here to make the old game look better this was pretty much the peak of need for speed right here need for speed carbon and this is what drifting in need for speed heat looks like dude the flames were bananas in need for speed heat <laughs> they definitely overdid the flames a little bit let's be honest but hey it's kind of cool to look at at least it's not cartoony flames right this game i'm gonna assume is gran turismo 7 we have the uh, back to the future vehicle over here the the lower on this nascar circuit throwing a 360 look at that we have a nissan s13 over here gotta flex with a 360 as well i mean how could you not right honestly everyone who can drift in beam and g you have my respect ice veil sent us this clip and boys that is not forza okay it's aceto corza looks magnificent over here custom map man has a logitech g920 steering wheel it seems has gloves on as well for a maximum grip roblox ladies and gentlemen look at that honestly looks pretty good on this clip i don't know which game it is kind of reminds me of the dark area in gta but yeah not the worst roblox drift game we have seen well i'm glad you guys never run out of ideas uh, this man has glued a frying pan on his trustmaster t300 base and he's drifting in a set of corza definitely unique thank you for the clip targo this is asphalt 9 and this game is both on mobile and pc and i just looked it up it is actually free on pc like the graphics ain't bad like this is what i'm gonna assume car street on pc is gonna look like to be honest dude that looks insanely good holy dude the graphics are dialed in over here lexus is 300 in front bmw e36 jason nice little tight tandem movie yeah and i believe this track was made by c trader as well gran turismo 7 look at that nissan s15 sliding dude that game looks amazing pure is a mustang i believe in forza motorsport 7 fun fact you can play this game on pc as well i have tried it it was a pretty good game now drifting is very difficult at least with a steering wheel but it's a beautiful game here is a nissan s13 look at this beautiful vehicle i think this is the nurburgring section if i'm not mistaken should be holy i cannot actually believe this is carx for a second i thought it was gta or a set of cores or something but this is actually carx that is one of the best maps i've seen is that a plane moving in the sky dude that is the best map i've seen in carx oh i love to see that a uh, volvo wagon boys sideways look at that throws a mad reverse entry as well what a lovely vehicle look at the dog there is dog on the wheel cam and the game is driver san francisco i mean we gotta show this game i really Really wish we could buy this game starts the chase with the cop over here this old game even had wheel support which is crazy the ai people walking around dude look at this truck in front with the ramp please tell me you're gonna take the jump he is okay best game ever All right this man has been drifting for way too long dude man doesn't even have tires on the rear mercedes over here says drifting in bmg on playstation 4 controller yeah you seem to be drifting pretty good i kind of want to know where you got that lovely mercedes mod from has a proper badge and everything look at the rear mirror there was a car approaching on the last second just swerves away so the porsche doesn't run him over what was that all about but yeah this man is now furious and out of pure anger takes the corner sideways boy check that out forza horizon 5 but it's a 
drag race and guys that supra is boosted and check it out we're going supra is leaving everyone in dust ain't nobody gonna win against the supra come on get out of here look at that beautiful that is super nasty dude. look at this color Sai jr drifting in a set of corsa with the controller so fun fact guys you don't actually need the steering wheel if you want to drift in a set of corsa you can just use a controller yeah lovely little tandem over here juicy supra in vanilla gta gta 5 supra over here check it out it's drifting no mods just pure skill here is someone probably trying to drift in a set of corsa for the first time maybe second time because i remember this track was the first track i ever tried in a set of corsa okay that is definitely not his first time he's drifting actually pretty good over there here is a lambo boys the lambo is racing check it out look at these cuts so we've got a muscle car passing him this is the crew too and he is doing a very weird stunt he just went into reverse someone with a trust master t300 steering wheel look at that doing some toge drifting flexing his rgb mouse over there as well and the rgb keyboard very nice here is a truck in bmng sideways look at that that's how you deliver your packages very nice truck this is the crew too i've never seen this mercedes sideways before that's definitely not a drift car but oh god he definitely ran somebody over jesus you gotta be careful this is a set of corsa using gran turismo user interface i guarantee you it's a set of corsa that car model looks good graphics dialed in and that's not even a drift car that's actually a, like a grip car okay now we're drifting we're sideways between ai cars dude look at the sky it's mesmerizing oh wait the sky changed i think he's flexing the sky yeah okay he's like flexing the sky i like it all these different skies gran turismo 7 dude that corvette looks lovely oh yeah and apparently it can drift pretty good look at that let me guess he's gonna do a 360 i just i know i know he's gonna do a 360 yep there we go yeah beautiful gran turismo amazing game absolutely dude you gotta clean your room whoa, 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 whoa. dude what is all that oh god look at the desk as well okay he's playing car x but let's you gotta clean your room a little bit well here is something interesting this is literally like an arcade game if you've seen these racing games arcade thing is i think this is literally the game that we're seeing here i don't know if he's playing on pc or not but uh yeah that looks cool gta 5 with some pretty mesmerizing graphics does a weird jump as well he's like levitating over here now i'm well aware some of you don't like the wet road affecting games i think the graphics look pretty good because we are gonna compare this clip to a vanilla gta 5 clip as well like sure it is reflective but you can't deny there is something about this clip that makes it look good right it's not just a wet road it's just satisfying to look at that's all so now let's compare this clip to the vanilla version as well so here is gta 5 without any graphics Come on, check it out and i'm not saying like gta 5 vanilla looks bad here's another type of max graphics clip over here the roads are a little less reflective there are still some puddles here and there but for me that is super weird is look at this physics he's just sideways go straight but sideways at the same time <laughs> Gran Turismo 7 once again, dude, that 350Z looks sick. Nighttime Shitoku Highway Street Racing and drifting as well. Okay, this clip is good. I love it. The only thing we're missing is like police sirens in the background. Oh my god, Scobra sent us this clip and it's a Fiat Multipla sideways. Why? Out of all the cars you could choose from, this monstrosity. I mean, it looks a little better with all the body kits and tuning on it. For reference, this is a completely stock looking Multipla. This definitely looks a little better. I'll give you that. If you haven't played this game, you're too young. Need for Speed most wanted the old one, the classic. Look at that, IS-200 flexing over here, or IS-300, whatever it is. This reminds me of the objects that fall down on police chases when you go through them. These were good times. Your favorite car, the Supra, which comes 1000 horsepower stock from the factory, every Supra guaranteed. Nowadays, they don't make Supras like that no more. BMW over here. Full speed throws a reverse entry. Check out this reverse entry. Still going. Now that's something. We have feed cam. I know you guys love your feed cams. Check it out. Three pedals. Logitech G29. Beautiful. 
This is very nice. Two cars over here. I think they're both BMWs. Having a little bit of fun on this roundabout. And this like little tiny village or something over here. Very nice scenery. Mountain in the background. Some nice buildings. Some park cars on the side. Just two BMWs drifting through the city. Kind of cinematic vibe over here. Euro truck simulated to clip to check that out. And the drifting is actually good. And it looks like this is in winter condition. So that probably helps. But man is like controlling the truck. Holding a decent slot. I don't know exactly how difficult it is to do. But it sure makes it seem easy. Gran Turismo 7 flashes his head lines over there because he's about to do something amazing i can feel it and boom we're sideways look at that now this clip does not do justice for gran turismo 7 that game has way better graphics than you can see on this clip and apparently drifting in fortnite is still a thing goes in reverse takes the drift cone in reverse flips it around and continues his drifting journey in fortnite gt5 is getting really popular nowadays there's another gt5 clip this actually could be vanilla graphics no also the drifting is just so satisfying in this game very underrated game for drifting pure is the famous dude who everyone is just Jealous of you look at his setup boom towards hammer tell me you're not jealous i won't believe you pure is a boss in gt5 and he's probably gonna do a 360 i mean what a, yep there we go he is oh well he definitely got a little help there oh well look at this dude bmw suv a proper mommy wagon sorry this is a daddy wagon yeah forget what i said this is a daddy wagon well definitely scratch his daddy wagon over there i did not know you could use a truck in the old need for speed game so i'm gonna assume this is a little modded oh and it can do 360s oh okay completely makes sense yep need for speed drift clip check it out boom sideways avoids these cars very narrowly here is need for speed most wanted again but not the old one the new one and of course gotta flex for the 360 here is someone's point of view drifting in winter castle road in carrex custom ship number over there as well logitech g920 i believe cinematic drift clip from is that beam and g no it's a set of corza yep that's the set of corza look at those AI traffic over there there's no way he's gonna drift through that there is he did impressive oh that is a nice cinematic clip over here check that out deep dish steering wheel as well i don't know what that shifter is it looks so small but again size doesn't matter it's what i've heard applies to anything in life bm oh, sorry the supra over here in forza horizon 5 boom crashes into the cliff just like bm supra's wood dude this man's wheel cam looks so clean look at that ferrari wheel on a trust master base ebay handbrake and logitech shifter man's whole setup is from a different brand every piece i like it and here's a real life clip with rc drift cars this is insane that would be my hobby if i had more time believe it or not that is a video game and my goodness it is looking absolutely stunning over here not only the graphics the drifting skills as well man is whipping through traffic like it's nothing with this bmw m5 throws a 360 as well what else do you want here is a porsche getting wrecked by a train oh my god, oh my god dude gta 5 this is probably one of the best looking gta 5 clips i have seen dude look at this drift the way he's like extending it with the handbrake as well 24 7 sideways this man is living life sideways it literally looks like it's rendered this doesn't even look like a gta 5 it's too good cop getting wrecked in need for speed a nissan s15 over here whipping it no idea what the track is nice little smoke show over here but what we're missing is a wheel cam please add it next time beam and g and dude look at the controller he's using a joystick to drift around in beam and g i didn't even think that was possible throws a 360 as well <laughs> guys you don't need a wheel you need a joystick here is some kind of an old need for speed game i'm not sure what it is exactly but i have a feeling he likes takumi Kyo is an audi in forge horizon 5 how do you do by the way 360 nice and smooth over here very satisfying here is a nissan 180sx in forge horizon 5 goes into reverse oh wait that was way better than i thought it would be wait he's still going wait this is actually a pretty good clip i thought it was just gonna be like a 360 this is better wait guys is this the truck that paul walker used is this paul walker's truck it has to be it looks really similar man i didn't know this truck could rip so hard in forza wait i gotta see if this is all the drive or every drive i don't even know it could be all the drive actually but this is absolutely gnarly dude look at his setup as well he has the ebay handbrake very clean wheel cam dude this is insane and i believe this is the new z that he is drifting throw the 360 over here as well oh two 360s three 360s four wait 
Infinite 360s. Here is something refreshing. JDM cars are overrated. Here, I believe, is an old school Camaro. It looks so flat and long, by the way. I like it. Here is a Seto Corza, a Lambo doing a 360 entry. Uh -huh. A Seto Corza once again. There's like a traffic jam. I don't know what is happening over here. Did the NPC cause the crash? <laughs> what? Dude, look at this setup. Triple monitor and we are in some kind of a VDC track. So we're going to be doing tandems on some kind of a steering wheel, which I can't see. It's blocked by this Giga Chad. Honestly, guys, let me know what is better. Triple monitor setup or VR? At this point, I don't even know. Not sure what car this is. Is it the Cadillac? If it's not, don't cancel me. But look at this angle. Man, is sideways. I think he went into reverse there for a second. That was a pretty magnificent drift and a very classic car. Here is the BMG clip, boys. He's go going into a tunnel a very narrow tunnel keep in mind this is beam and jeep he does a little crash he's done look at this narrowness he's sideways inside of a tunnel there is a jump outside of a tunnel jumps into a new tunnel what kind of sorcery is this oh baby this looks good a skyline whipping in wait i think i know this map osaka nanko dude the cinematics the graphics are on point over here i've tried this map out personally as well i love it the only thing i wish i just wish it was a little bigger it's kind of a small map it can't get much better than that boys here is an interesting clip boys first person view tandem drift clip in forza motorsport 7 i believe bmw e92 or i guess you could call it m3 here is a clip sent by youtube channel called crash experience let's check it out he's probably gonna crash hasn't crashed yet oh there we go yep there is the crash lost one tire already <laughs> and he's done here's a pretty gnarly drift clip as well again the new z the guys the new z is getting really popular honestly the new z i love the rear end but i don't like the front end but that was a sick 360 jump i think that's from a different angle oh yeah that is pretty good here is an interesting view, Aceto Corza, and he's gonna drift all the way to the top or bottom. I don't know which direction he's going. Wait, let me skip ahead. Okay, I think he came from downwards to upwards. Yeah, okay, now he's out of the tunnel. Very cool. Here is the BMG clip by Georgian, and he's whipping it. Probably gonna do a 360. No, it's a mad reverse entry. That's even better. That was clean. Here is Aceto Corza again with them juicy graphics. Just look at this. And obviously, you do get a throw that 360 as well but man is in control respect have you seen a toilet drift in need for speed well now you have you're welcome big massive jump in forza horizon 4 goes over the bridge lands nicely but ruins everything at the end this is how cars are made ladies and gentlemen uh, or this is the closest tandem i've ever seen you cannot get closer than that here is bmg and i have a feeling we're gonna see an epic jump and here with this is it gonna be a reverse 360 it's a 360 flawless guys the most tiniest car in forza doing a 360 very impressive boys size doesn't matter here is a very controversial vehicle guys this is rx7 two big hard cannons as well but guys it's a wagon it literally looks like it's an aquarium like a fish could live in the back of that rx7 this is a custom wheel made out of legos and it actually works. Look at the in-game wheel. It, it's, it moves. Here is someone flexing with their Ferrari wheel. Cable management in the background looking horrible. He's drifting with one hand in BMG. Good job. BMW over here with a mad 360. Easy. A wise man once said everyone loves a white chaser and white chaser is here. Look at that. City looks pretty cool as well pretty decent graphics headphone users warning this is a very loud car sideways drifting sent us this clip now i remember his previous clip he had a cat on the clip as well but just very clean setup one of the cleanest setups i've seen like just, it looks bonkers i think is the word here is a very old car a very long sausage are you gonna drift that I think we both know the answer to that. Yep, he is sideways with it. For some reason, these old cars are really good drift cars in Forza. I don't know why. Forza Horizon 5 once again over here. FT spec Nissan S15, I believe. Wait, it's S14. Just the headlights are a little different. Okay. Here is a clip from iRacing. There is a NASCAR sideways, which is way harder than it looks like. 
Cure is the crew too. And oh my god, that was the fastest 360 I've ever seen. Boys, electric cars are the future. Even in video games. Here is an electric car sideways, absolutely throwing mad angle. We can't escape the electric cars. This is the future. This is cool. Guys, that game is Motor Town. And people apparently drift in this game. Now the drifting looks really slow. And this car is definitely modded. I don't think this car exists in the game by default but a very unique game for drifting and this is what drifting in need for speed it looks like here is need for speed rivals it's an older need for speed game by today's standards and i think it just evaded the cop or something oh baby dude look at this are you kidding me like honestly the graphics are better than real life again i haven't been outside recently don't know what it's like but dude look at these graphics 4k 1080p 60 fps ai w i have no idea what i'm saying at the moment i'm just looking at the beautiful clip old school skyline i believe r31 with these boxy looking taillights that is pretty good max boost thank you boys test drive unlimited 2 and yes, you can drift in this game. I didn't know that, to be honest. I've seen some attempts, but look at that. Here is a 360 as well. Slow motion with some kind of an old Mustang. Makes it look so easy. GTA 5 stunt, dude. We haven't seen those in a while. Full sense off the cliff. And that is a perfect landing as well. 10 out of 10. And it just keeps on drifting. Beautiful. Here is a real life drift cliff. Someone is having fun on a circuit. No, guys, that is not Assetto Corza. Although, pretty simple similar graphics to be honest here is someone fooling around with their mercedes during winter boys never grow up their toys just get bigger that's the proof right here and here is another real life clip boy check it out i think that's a bmw e36 if i'm not mistaken hopefully you enjoyed this video if you did make sure you like make sure you subscribe and as always stay sideways Peace.